Hello, and welcome to another episode of King on Things. I'm your host, Robert, and today we're going to be unboxing another flashlight. Um, This light, specific light, really appealed to me because it has an OLED display on it. Um, And we'll get more into that after we do the unboxing, but uh, it was really something that caught my eye. So I decided to purchase it and do an unboxing for you to, to check this out. So without further ado, let's get into the unboxing. So this is a Nightcore TUP1000 um, 1000 lumen uh, rechargeable EDC flashlight. So we'll see how EDC this is because it looks a little bulky in the uh, um, pictures I've seen. But let's take a look at how it looks uh, here in person. Oh, wow. That's tiny. <laughs> thought it was gonna be so much bigger than this wow that is so tiny oh my goodness that is literally i I am that this is genuine surprise i cannot believe how small (laughs) that is a small light anyway and that's the led display right there let me take that off there let's see if we can get it to work here oh yeah it's working maybe it's locked I'll have to look that up, but anyway, oh, something's happening here. Um, so, so let's go into the specs on this. Um, well, first, let's look at what else comes in here. Looks like a uh, is that a warranty code to register? I guess. Um, here's the warranty indi- uh, instructions, and I guess it has a little clip. This is tiny, unbelievable. Um, definitely carryable. And look at that clip too. That's a pretty robust clip there. This is, this is super small. I really like it. I do. Um, don't know if it's going to take over the wedge though, because the the wedge is my EDC. But let's look at, let's, let's do a comparison. Let's do a comparison really quick. So here's the wedge and here's the, uh, TUP 1000. So both kind of, uh. I don't know. Pretty neat. I don't like tip up. Um, let's see. Can I reverse that? No, no way to reverse that. Um, I like the flashlight to be facing downwards because I always worry that something's going to happen to the lens. But anyhow, let's go into the specs on this. Um, so as I mentioned, the max output on this is 1000 lumens, um, for a peak distance of 197 yards and a peak and uh, beam intensity of 8,130 candela. It has an IP rating of uh, IP54, an impact resistance of one meter, um, and the dimensions are, and that's what I should have looked at. I didn't look at this when I bought it. It's tiny. I, I like it though. Um, it's 2.76 inches long, 1.16 uh, inches wide, and um, 1.16 inches high. So uh, it weighs a mere 1.87 ounces. So nice and small and light. And it's, it's cool. I, I'll give it cool factors like a 10 on this. It's super cool. Um, here's the various outputs. So you have a turbo, a high, a mid, a low, and an ultra low. I'm trying to see if it has strobing, um, which as you know on here, if you've listened to any of my flashlight reviews, I love strobing. Um, I don't see strobing and that bothers me just a little bit, but maybe it has it. Um, so the, the turbo mode, as I mentioned, is the 1000 lumens, um, at 15 minutes, the high mode is 200 lumens. So how that varies from the wedge is the wedge is, uh, kind of the regular standard mode. That's not turbo is, uh, 300 lumens. So it has a little more general light than this does, but um, this only will run for a couple minutes uh, at 1000. This can run for 15 minutes at 1000. Um, the mid on here is 65 lumens. The low on here is 15 lumens and the ultra low is just one lumen. Um, oh, sorry. Let me go over the times on that. So the mid is nine hours and 45 minutes at 65 lumens. The low is 19 hours at 15 lumens and the ultra low is 70 hours at one lumen. So, um, the battery in here is a, uh, 1200, um, MAH lithium ion. So, um, expect that it should, uh, um, provide you, you know, years of use. Um, and it, let me see this lockout. Uh, let's see here. So it has a full lockout. That's what it's probably in now. 
um, and it only allows you to activate the turbo um, by holding the mode button. Okay, so that's cool. There's a couple different kind of lockouts you can program in. Anyhow, it's a really cool light. Let's see if we can get... I don't want to mess with the instructions or right now or get it turning on, so um, I guess I won't uh, try to unlock it just yet because I also want to put it through a full charge. don't know how charged up it is, so... All right, um, so if you guys have any questions or comments on this light, man, that's small, um, please feel free to put them in the comment section. Um, I'll do my best to uh, get back to you. I believe I got this for $59.95 on Amazon. So definitely a good deal for the for this tiny light um, and, and something that would be very handy. Um, you can put it in your car, um, you know, center console or in your glove box. It's all, all kinds of things you could do with this. So it's really, um, convenient because of its size, but anyhow, like, comment, subscribe. And I promise you guys who are knife buffs, the next video will be a knife video. So I've got something that I kind of really want to share. So, um, that'll be, uh, the next video will be a knife video. Thank you so much, and I'll talk to you guys in the next video. See ya. Bye.